and students of a unnamed, for legal reasons, theological college. For those of you who don't know, I actually work in a theological college in London. Yes, that's right, I work there. I'm not a student despite my youthful good looks. In the last edition of the college newspaper, it mentioned that I was supposed to be putting together a book list for titles you should not read next year. This took me somewhat by surprise, however, I have risen to the challenge. So here, for the students and anyone else who would like to go to theological college, here are three titles you should not read. Title number one, The Hungry Caterpillar by Eric Carle. Now some of you may think reading this book will prepare you for a life of ministry. But you couldn't be more wrong. Not only is the writing very basic, but if you know anything about the caterpillar life cycle, you will find this book very, very predictable. Book number two, Fifty Shades of Grey by E. L. James. Despite the title, this is not a book about moral ambiguity in our modern culture. But outside of college, it is a good read, especially if you enjoy repeated uses of words like throbbing. Book number three, The Necronomicon. This is an ancient book, which holds the secrets to reanimating the dead and summoning the old ones to destroy the earth. Some of you may want to copy Jesus in the sense that you can bring the dead back to life. This is not the book to do it with. Also, reading the book may cause madness and insanity. For example, chapter four. <laughs> Thank you.